All right, y'all, let's get right into the video, man. We are going to be reacting to the Tea Room, as y'all can tell by the title. What we're going to be getting into today, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, as you hit that bell to be notified when I upload on my channel. DM me lit videos to react to and tell a friend to tell a friend. Tell the angel mama to tell the uncle Joey still a hoe. Let's get right into the video, man. Let's get it. So Nike and Royalty are going at it again. Now first, Royalty... Girl, the way you got dragged in them Prada shoes, you should keep your keep my name out your mouth. Worry about my my pussy. And your kid has... What? Fuck shit? MS? What, what's that? Let me know in the comment section down below. <laughs> Posted on Instagram, CJ So Messy. Girl, the way you got... Right, it should be CJ So Messy instead of CJ So Cool. What it say? Your best friend, baby daddy, sent me the video. Wow. Got dragged in them Prada shoes. You should keep my name out your mouth. mouth. P.S. Your best friend, baby daddy, sent me the video. And then she says, worried about my cat and your kid <clears throat> has Fs. Now then... Miss oh, Nike. Fs. Why does they fuck shit? Nike responds and she said, Oh my God. Drag where? Oh, because she had my braids. Charlene, you weak as hell. Why you ain't at me since you tough? You been out all month. As soon as I hit your city, you put up. You eat, sleep, and shit me. Talking about worried about you. When I talk to my baby daddy, you always speaking on me. You scared in real life. 400 credit score. Having no diploma. Bum. Wow. Oh, and you steady speaking on my child. Tell the people how your kids missed a month of school because you was broke and couldn't travel back and forth to drop them off. Tell them how your youngest son had a black eye because you was getting drunk instead of stacking your bread and watching your kids. Why you always wait till I leave to play with me? I hate that for you, sweetheart. Whoop me since I was dragged. Are you mad because you wasn't, wanted to take CJ to breakfast, but he had no time for you? Or when you text him saying you needed some loving and the thing wasn't delivered? You so clean, but that old house was nasty as hell. GTFO. She needs some more paint. So why wouldn't she come bothering me? She got to pay rent and bills. She needs the views. She know what she doing. Even the people I know, she... All right. Wow, that's tough. That is tough. CJ would never, baby. What? House furnished out the flea market. Not the flea market. CJ would never, baby. Please, I swear to God, I can't even let Shorty take me there for real. What is wrong? First, we got King and Lena and Ashley. Now we have CJ royalty and Nike. Like women, y'all have to raise your standards and y'all have to motherfucking want better for yourself than to be arguing about a nigga. All right, who's probably doing him at the end of the day. But anyway. Now then Royalty comes back and responds with, Girl, Girl go, go suck, suck on CJ's, CJ's toes, toes for a BBL. BBL. And didn't you just <laughs> lose your job because you was calling off so much? Girl, Girl your, your whole, whole apartment, apartment looked like, looked like the, the flea, flea market. market. Now how did Royalty oh know God. that Nike lost her job? Someone must have been chatting. Then Royalty Maybe CJ so messy. See, post the video of Nike getting dragged on mm. OnlyFans. She says, Watch Nike get dragged. Now then Nike She making a bag off of that shit. That's crazy. Comes back and states, please post it so I can send my lawyer for my cut and you right. know I am playing. We Facts. gonna make paper together. Then she says she, she needs, needs some, some money. money. I knew it. Yeah, y'all let her be great. I lost one, one job, job and got an offer, offer for, for two. two. Shit, I done got fired from a job before. Fuck that job and fuck them. What a Look at me now. Whoa. About you. And then <laughs> she says, Toes, I ain't I have to do, do a thing, thing for nothing, nothing especially, especially no BBL. BBL. I'm not you. You, you had, had to work, to work for everything, everything you did. All I did was show up. We what? Is that something to fucking brag about, y'all? Maybe she's talking about in the relationship with CJ. She's got to be talking about that. Because I respect somebody who worked for everything that they got rather than somebody who just got, you know, a silver spoon or somebody just who just had to show up and, and receive whatever it was. Maybe she's talking about the relationship with CJ. You know, she just had to show up and, you know, royalty had to work for CJ. I don't know. It had to be that. Not the same. Then she says she already spoke on everything that royalty posted. So maybe she spoke on getting fired somewhere in one of her videos. I must have missed that part. But anyways, you guys let me know what you guys think about this down A in damn the comment mess. section below. This seems like it's going to be... I was trying to see the video though. But again, let's move <laughs> on to this next topic with King, Ashley, and Lena. So now apparently after some receipts were dropped, 
people started to notice that the pregnancy test that Ashley posted in that video did not match the pregnancy test on the box. As you can see here, the pregnancy test on the box is a flip and click, mm -hmm. and Ashley actually has a digital pregnancy test. Mm. You got caught. You set yourself so up. My thing is, what's so difficult? If you're going to show all of this to try to prove something, why wouldn't you show the documentation from the miscarriage? I don't understand that. It is. This is the cookie. And then after that, just call it a day. After that, it literally came out of, like, how, how is this not real, bro? Like, I don't mind taking a test, but I can't take it. I literally just opened the second one. You see? Two coming here. That's the first one. This is the second one. I have not taken this one yet. I have to wait. I have to wait. I will try again tonight or in the morning. But I'm just letting you know, I this is a real test, like... There's nothing different about neither one of these. These are real. Like, I don't know how can you pay me to be a f liar, dude. Ashley and Lena then begin to go back and forth on Twitter mm. because Lena states the test not adding up digital tests, but a flip and click box. That's tough. Yo, you're done and no cap. Damn. So then Ashley responds with, it's literally a digital test. How can you fake a digital test? You just sound dumb. Now, what? I'm going to let you guys read through these tweets. So uh, what I'm guessing is this one. Okay, it's going to say it's pregnant, so it's digital. This one right here shows you positive or neg negative when you piss on the stick right here. So this one is not digital. It's like, or maybe it is digital, but it only it shows positive or negative. Let me know. I don't know how that shit works. So you can hear what both Ashley and Lena had to say, but Ashley actually went live and I did ask her about this on live and this was her response. What did she say? My daily scratch. If I didn't have a quick weave, I would literally oil my scalp every day. But since I got this quick weave, I can't even fucking put. Can you explain the test? Like why did the test not match? Look, T Roll trying to get all the tea. <laughs> She's trying to get all the tea. Boxes, okay. Okay. Two of them was the clicks. Two of them was the digital. I took three tests in total. I did not take the fourth one. I sent him two, both of the digital ones. Didn't bother sending the third one because that was pointless. I don't know what else there is to explain about that part. Like. Show the paperwork from the miscarriage. That's what we want to see and then dead the shit. But in the actual video, I'm literally like sitting here scrambling with everything that's on my bathroom counter. Like I'm pissed. I'm slapping stuff everywhere. Like you can see both of the digital tests side by side. Literally sitting side by side. So, okay, I picked up the wrong box. Who cares? Why are y'all avoiding the actual fucking test? Y'all worried about the damn one of the boxes. I don't trust her ass as far as I can throw her, y'all. I'm confused. I ain't the gonna test lie. is not enough for y'all. Like, I don't have anything else. To right, say. where's the documentation from the doctor? What else do you want? And that's another thing, okay? Like, somebody just said, why Elena don't want to acknowledge the I miss you part, all right? So, yeah. You know, a couple of you guys were telling me that at the time of the text messages, King wasn't committed to either or. And like I said in the previous video, man, a val Valentine's Day was approaching, so he was going to have to make his decision which girl he wanted to, like, really not take serious, but, you know put one over the other so he chose lena so i want to know if she has any screenshots after february like in march april may june july do you have any other receipts or proof that he was still talking to you while cutting you off i mean after cutting you off to be with lena that's what i want to see because the screenshots that she sent were in february so, like, you know what I'm saying? They really don't mean anything. 
All right. And somebody had commented that I forgot who commented that. Let me know in the comment section down below. But yeah, I had peeped that too. I was like, okay, so the screenshots that you're showing us are from February, but he really didn't make a decision until, you know, February when he wanted to take one over the other on a Valentine's Day date or whatever the case may be. So if she does not have any text messages, proof or receipts of him communicating with her after February, then really this situation really doesn't even mean anything, guys. Let me know how y'all feel. Exactly. Like, what the fuck? I gave y'all. I have yet to lie about anything that has came out of my mouth. So why the fuck doubt would it. I lie about this? I if y'all think I'm lying, that's cool. I didn't already gave enough proof. I don't have to do nothing else at this point. I don't have to do anything else. I dropped everything. Because you ain't got nothing else. That is it. She ain't got no documentation. Really, that's, that is completely fine with me. Mm. But to, for me to go to the extent of posting my mic, like, y'all, y'all are wild y'all are crazy not once did i lie about anything that has came out of my mouth and i've always had proof of everything without a problem without a problem always had proof of everything so why the fuck would i sit here and lie about this shit come on now so i definitely want your thoughts on this down in the well, T Room, my thoughts on it is, you know, I can't really trust her as far as I can throw her. And, you know, I feel like the whole situation is being drug out because on both sides, they're trying to get the coin, okay? They want to make it make sense. They want to make it make sense. They want to make it make dollars. So I understand it. I get it. So we will see if anything further happens from the situation, but I believe that it should be dead. If you're not going to show any receipts or documentation from the miscarriage at this point, like, fuck it. All right. Who cares at this point? Let me know how y'all feel in the comment section down below. Make sure that you do give this video a like, a comment, a subscribe as you hit that bell to be notified when I upload on my channel. DM me lit videos to react to a tell a friend to tell a friend. Tell the angel mama to tell the uncle Joey still a hoe. See you guys in the next motherfucking video. I love y'all, man. Peace. We out, baby.